Have you ever considered the fragility of a spider's web? Have you taken time to marvel at the intricacy of its design, yet recognized its temporary nature? Do you sometimes find yourself entangled in such an illusory web? Have you contemplated the repercussions of relying on such flimsy foundations? Isaiah 59.5 reads, They hatch the eggs of vipers and weave a spider's web. Whoever eats their eggs will die. Crack one open and a viper is hatched. Spider's web serves as a metaphor for hypocritical faith, attractive yet deceptive, skillfully designed but inherently fragile. It is a facade meant to capture the admiration of the unsuspecting. Just as a spider traps its prey, the hypocrite snares the naive with false professions of faith. Such falsified faith is truly a marvel. Its capacity to deceive, to cloak an outright lie in the guise of truth, is astounding. The glistening facade is so convincingly crafted that it often passes for gold. Pretentious faith, much like a spider's web, is woven from the very being of the hypocrite. Unlike the bee that collects wax from flowers, the hypocrites need no external resources. They rely solely on themselves, building their house of faith on self-made foundations. They dismiss the idea of owing anything to God's grace. Despite its appearance, however, the spider's web is incredibly fragile. It may survive for a time, but it cannot endure. It is easily dismantled, brought down by a broom or a walking stick. Similarly, the hypocrite's faith, built on falsehood, cannot withstand the winds of truth. When faced with God's purification, their cobwebs of deceit will inevitably crumble. Therefore, let us not build our faith on a spider's web. Let our trust stand solely in the Lord Jesus, our steadfast and eternal shelter. O oh Lord, you are the unshakable foundation. Teach us to discern truth from deceit. Let our faith be genuine, steadfast, and anchored in you. Deliver us from the fragile web of hypocrisy.